Hey guys, I want to go ahead and show you uh, something that I picked up yesterday, um, and I got it from the Sinful, Sinful iPhone repo. Uh, there's the link right there that you're going to have to enter in because it's, uh, uh, well, I had to enter it in uh, into my sources in Cydia. Um, now yesterday, uh, AT&T finally allowed everybody using iPhones to get MMS. Um, what they did do though also was take away the functionality of tethering to your iPhone oh, from your iPhone to your laptop or computer um, this is a pretty annoying thing so the good folks somewhere out there uh, were able to give you the functionality back uh, along with MMS so once you have the simple iPhone repo let's go into it and what you're going to end up looking for and I gotta let you know that I have a 3GS and it's running on 3.0 um, okay here we go there it is right there MMS and tethering settings what you do is you just install that and it gives you directions to go into your settings and then to your network settings and then to clear all your network settings and then when you do that it's going to restart your your phone and when it comes back you're going to have MMS in your uh, uh, instant I'm sorry your text messages and tethering still available just like it was when you had that uh, the uh, IPCC file that you had to install to get tethering working a little while ago and it all still works. Let me go ahead and sort of prove that. Go ahead and hit text messages. And here's one I sent to my sister just a little while ago. Uh, there's a video that I sent her. Um, and I want to go into. Uh, where is it? My settings. Oh, what is this? Uh, go into my settings, go into general. Network. And internet tethering. Right now it's off because I don't need it right now, but there it is. Go ahead and click on it. And I'm able to turn it on just like I uh, would be otherwise uh, when, before this uh, new update that they put out. So um, go ahead and give it a try, guys. You're going to have tethering along with MMS. And you can't do that if you updated the other way through iTunes.